preached his first message a couple weeks ago. And looking forward to what God is doing and is going to continue to do in his life. All right. Matthew uh, chapter 10. I'm going to read verse 32. The Bible says, uh, Whosoever therefore shall confess me before men, him will I also confess before my Father which is in heaven. And if we uh, go over to Romans chapter 1. And go to verse 16. It says, For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God unto salvation to everyone that believeth to the Jew first and also to the Greek. Lord, help me speak... Uh, the words you would want me to speak out of this, this book that has your uh, promises to mankind. God, I pray that you would uh, speak through me, have me speak every word I should and not a word I shouldn't. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Amen. <coughs> to the book of Matthew where it says, Whosoever shall confess me before men, to him I will also confess to my Father which is in heaven. This is one I have to deal with constantly at school. Because at my school there are countless, countless atheists and all kinds of different religions that my school has. And it's a constant battle because many of them, I come into school in the morning and some of them say, yeah, I went to a party last night and did all this awful, awful stuff. And I keep thinking, man, I need to start talking about what this Bible says. I've even, I've even got to the point in my school where I've been uh, saying stuff like this and it's uh, been making a little people mad. But I don't think I should stop because many of them, I think, are actually listening to me. Because um, Christ expects us to acknowledge Him to others. And a Christian should not be ashamed to follow Jesus Christ, which is what a lot of Christians today are actually having a problem with. Christians are ashamed to follow Jesus Christ. And that's uh, not the way you need to do it because what it says right here is to Him... One second, let me find it. But whosoever shall deny me before men, him I will also deny my Father which is in heaven. And uh, that's, that's kind of sad because sometimes a Christian, they get, they're ashamed to be a Christian, but they think that they're, uh, they're saved. And one day uh, they're going to have, have them told, depart from me, I never knew you, when verse 33 comes up. And it's going to be a sad, sad time for them. Confess to Christ to others, and Christ will uh, confess you to His Father. It, uh, so just, I challenge everyone here, when you go to work or go to school, I challenge you to talk about God to others and tell them how amazing Jesus Christ is. Maybe someone will hear you and you might make the difference in their life. That's all i got to say. Amen.